So Paris Saint-Germain get us underway. Here holiday. Neymar and Messi absent too, but straight away. Ball flighted forward towards Hugo Ikiti came at a difficult angle. Did well to force the save from Paul Delacroix. Win it back. Let's see what they can do in possession. They've got themselves a free kick given by the referee, Bastian Deschepi. And uh, Nordi Mukiele has hurt himself in the contact. Well, clearly a painful one for uh, Mukiele. come to Garby on the edge of the box Ekitike again and there is the opening goal well Hugo Ekitike is threatened a few times in the opening minutes and it is he who breaks the deadlock Christophe Galtier without Kylian Mbappe without Neymar without Lionel Messi tonight but Hugo Ekitike scores for the third time in four games for Paris Saint-Germain. Vitinha looking for Mukiele. Brought down well by Mukiele and may have been caught in two minds between trying to shoot and trying to square it for Hugo Ekitike. In the end, he didn't do either. It's going to touch off the defender, to be fair. And with Viltar. The ball in towards the back post. It might just fall here for the shot, which is deflected behind. And, uh, well, we were centimetres away from the equalising goal. Really important intervention from Vitinha to stop that shot from Jonathan Mexique. Thank you, TK. Here is Ismail Garbi. Paris Saint-Germain just a bit slow with the counter-attack and it allowed Chateauru to get men back and uh, eventually concede the free kick that's a big opportunity wasted for the home team they're in a promising position lighted in by Soler cleared away but it's going to fall to Garpi great strike from the youngster and a great save from the Chateauru goalkeeper first senior start tonight for Ismail Garpi and he's already shown up very well in the opening exchanges here the 18 year old nearly making it 2 0. Sarabia. Who again? It's good build up play from the home team and it's gone in. Well, it's a horrible mix up at the back for Paris Saint Germain. And it might even be an own goal. But the Chateau fans celebrate an unlikely equaliser. Maxence Flaché's team, to be fair to them, have created a couple of uh, decent opportunities since falling behind. Patient build-up play here into the middle. Can Nolan Rue make anything of it? Tries the shot, which is just wide of the far post. Nolan Rue's not scored a goal this season. He is a player with great pedigree, 34 years old now. And... Uh, a headline grabbing signing when he arrived at the beginning of last season having spent the and Chateauroux get us underway then in the second half Hugo Ek before kickoff Mukiele's attempt to cross has turned behind for the first corner of the second half running again from Mukiele Florian Bianchini trying to find Nolan Roux in the middle a really important touch off uh, Marquinhos and it's going to be a Chateauru corner while well, Nolan Roux hasn't scored a goal this season remember but he's uh, starred in the top flight against PSG in the past for and goalkeepers it's my fact that Gianluigi Donnarumma has been rested altogether tonight so El Shaddai beat Shiabu made his first Ligue 1 start 10 days ago against uh, Strasbourg returning to the starting lineup tonight in central defence but replaced by the veteran Sergio Ramos who gets a bit of a mixed reception from the home crowd here and Ismail Garbi the talented young midfield the tournament favourites tonight Damian Ruiz with the low shot saved again by Paul de Lacroix coming up to the midway point in the second half here 
and at the moment Paris Saint-Germain toiling not particularly looking like uh, taking the lead here not somebody who offers them much in an attacking sense Juan Bernat went down very easily Dorian Bianchini it was with the challenge Vitinha Vitinha under pressure holds the ball up to the back post it's a brilliant save by Delacroix but Carlos Soler is there to score the follow up and Paris Saint-Germain are back in front at a crucial time in the game and we're starting to worry about the prospect of an embarrassing cup upset are being taken to penalty shootout by their third division opponents but they have finally got that in the first of four added minutes here Paris Saint-Germain looking to finally end this one as a contest it's a terrific strike from Juan Bernat and at last it is game over well they've accelerated away in the closing minutes of this game their uh, superior quality is finally told and a rare...